Hamas, no hostages for prisoner swap deal with Israel unless Gaza war ends. Reuters Hamas acting Gaza chief Khalil al haya said in remarks broadcast on Wednesday that there would be no hostages for prisoners swap deal with Israel unless the war in the Palestinian enclave ended. Without an end to the war, there can be no prisoner swap, Haya said in a televised interview with T. He groups Al-Aqsa television channel, reiterating the group's position on how to bring the war to a an end. If the aggression is not ended, why would the resistance and in particular Hamas, return th? 00. Below are your comments. If Hamas has rejected all prisoner swaps and says they won't release any hostages until the war ends, then there is no need for further talks. My two-year-old grandson attempted to negotiate a later bedtime with me last week, thinking he was I. In a position to do so. It was cute. Well the war can't end, unless the hostages are released first. So it seems we have reached an impasse. They only answer I see, is to ramp up attacks on the terrorist, until they change their minds. If the aggression is not ended, why would the resistance and in particular Hamas, return the prison? R.S. Hostages. He said. How would a sane or an insane person lose a strong card he owns while the war is continuing? The war is continuing because you still have hostages. This guy has it backwards. Give up the hostages first, then surrender, then there can be peace. No hostages, no surrender means no peace. Return the people you stole and use like a bargaining chip. Completely surrender to the Israeli forces and there will be peace. Hamas says no release or swap unless the war is ended. And the reason why they won't agree to a swap is because unfortunately there is only a very small H. And full of hostages still alive. Please subscribe to my channel. And if you like it, please thumbs up.